so question number 11 we are told uh, the figure a b c d e f g h represent a box uh, the top lid of the box is open such that the height ot is at 5 calculate the angle a uh, the angle the top lid makes with the plane f g h a so looking at our diagram uh, where is our FGA? So this is the uh, uh, this is the F uh, G uh, H A and the top read. So it's like uh, now this is the angle between two frames that is H G, uh, the one that is indicated for, and here we can f put the uh, image of H. That's a diff that's the angle between two planes. The angle between two planes when you are doing three dimension in form four is the angle between the line the the, the line uh, which are perpendicular to the two planes uh, so and makes an angle of ninety at the at the line with the line of intersection. So if we drop a line from T uh, and this is a, this is a, another line. Uh, on that plane uh, which we can uh, put it halfway uh, so we can be able to get now the we, we are get that is the angle between the two planes uh, now we know this from here this is a uh, 50 so from uh, the open lead uh, this is 50 and since we are told OT is 35 and CF is 10 so it means from here uh, to here it is 25 and therefore we can use now the trig ratio to get the angle between the two planes and you say you use, you use the sine uh, we say, say sine uh, theta is equals to opposite opposite is 25 and the hypotenuse is 50 that is from the triangle that we have formed there which will give you a half so if you get the sign inverse of a half uh, which you can get directly from your calculator that is you type uh, uh, 30 uh, or 0 0.5 you, you press in as uh, inverse and then sign that will give you 30 degrees so the angle between the two prints is 30 degrees uh, part b uh, the length b e correct to two decimal places so b e we can be able to show this is a diagonal passing through uh, the box and to get that we can say that uh, uh, b d e is a right angle triangle and therefore we can say b e is equals to uh, the square root using the Pythagoras theorem uh, we can say it is the square root of uh, BD uh, squared uh, plus uh, DE squared but we don't know BE BD uh, but we can say BD is the same as BC the square root of BC squared plus CD squared so we can replace BD uh, with uh, BC squared uh, plus CD squared then we have plus DE uh, squared so with this which we have the values we can be able to get BE so we get this is uh, a 90 squared that is BC uh, plus 50 squared 50 squared uh, plus 10 squared uh, using your calculator you should be able to get that is equals to uh, it is equals to the square root of 10,700 using your calculator which when you get the square root of this you get it is 103.44 uh, uh, this is a centimeter and this is to two uh, decimal places very important because that value will give you a decimal that has more than two decimal places so that is how you work out that question and you'll be able to score four marks